this is my labor of love. Um, peeling the leaves off the kale stalks. Um, kale is such a wonderful like spinach, uh, great vegetable, but the stalks are just too hardy to eat. They're just too fibrous. Um, they break down difficult in our body, so um, best to just peel off the leaves and uh, we can do such amazing things with these leaves. Um, I've got two bowls going here. One bowl I'm going to make kale chips. So what I'm going to do is um, put some olive oil in the bowl, just kind of rub it into the chips, salt and pepper, and then put it in the oven. Um, but I think just bake it for like 20, uh, not even 20 minutes, maybe 15 minutes um, on a low temperature. Just watch it that it becomes nice and crisp and, and like dried out but not burnt and to me kale chips are just phenomenal they taste like popcorn even better I know that sounds strange to be thinking that kale could possibly taste like popcorn but if you just give it a chance and just let the flavor just taste the flavor and not get put off by the green um, it's really yummy the second thing that I'm going to do is make a kale salad so again, because the leaves too are quite rough and fibrous, you just need to let them break down a bit. And using natural vinegars, um, apple cider vinegar, or some, we've got some shallots here that I'm going to cut up, or onion, and you put that in the salad with a little bit of olive oil or avocado as your, um, as your uh, oil, with the vinegar, the kale, the onions. Oh, it's so good. You can even then grate some parmesan, cheese in there um, as an alternative and um, yeah I mean just kale is such a wonderful vegetable but it is it is a little tricky to know what to do with it when I first got kale I definitely looked at this thing and said well what now so now that I've learned how to cook and use it um, it's a nice time that you just spend in the kitchen yeah, getting it ready okay so here's my final product I decided to go with some garlic flakes in there. I put molasses um, just for to bake up a little bit of the hardiness. Apple cider vinegar. Um, I used tahini actually I decided to use as like a like a cheese um, type type of taste. Uh, salt and, and I use celery salt that I like from Nature's Choice and black pepper and then just really just got the hands in there and massaged that all into the leaves. I'll put that in the fridge and that is going to be really yummy. And here it is. Kale chips. Very crunchy. And this is just amazing. To me this is like popcorn. So, so good.